students how are you i hope you are quite well and of course you will have been waiting for a long time of your new session of online classes now i am introducing a new chapter the first chapter of your new book that is food prints without feed the book name is food prints without feed and the title the chapter name is the crime of surgery it is the first chapter of this book as you know very well in our last videos okay you studied about the chapters the poetry chapters and the fiction chapters of your the first flight to book now let's have a look the chapter name is triumph of a surgery okay means a victory a victory of surgery written by james harriot james harriot no doubt is a versatile writer as well as famous veterinary surgeon british veterinary surgeon and he wrote many series of books related with the experiences of the pets and their owners and out of those books and series the first chapter of your book is the triumph of surgery a triumph of surgery there are many phases of this chapter phase by phase or step by step i'll tell you i'll describe you about this chapter the whole story surrounds with the series of the caring of a pet but that type of caring is really wonderful is really healthy or not okay we will discuss it the introduction with characters means the characters of this chapter mrs pumphrey the owner of a pet a small dog means tricky james harriet he is the writer of this chapter the british writer as well as veterinary surgeon as i have told you tricky a small dog okay pet and there is a great bonding between mrs pumphrey and her dog her pet but mrs pumphrey no doubt is a rich woman she is having too much luxurious facilities but this luxurious life is no doubt very comfortable but how it creates discomfort for her pet means which type of discomfort you think this thing in your mind discomfort means the diet the imbalanced diet the extras between meals what mrs pumphrey is giving in 24 hours to her dog tricky now the second phase is the shock of mr harriet why mr harriet is really shocked why he is so depressed the reason of his shocked is the appearance the critical condition of the dog tricky as soon as mr harriet is passing by tricky and he is walking on the road he saw the condition of tricky tricky is not well i think the appearance of tricky is very bulky he is looking like bloated sausages the eyes of tricky are not well okay the eyes of tricky looking like rumi and blood shot after seeing the condition of tricky mr harriet asked many questions many doubts from the owner of tricky after that the stressful explanation from mrs pumphrey the hasan explanation the depressed explanation came out mrs pumphrey said my dog is listless okay he is losing the energy he is not enthusiastic to play he is not enthusiastic and energetic to take the exercises to take the meal to take any type of activity what what i want to make him to all these explanations 
very well explained by Mrs. Pomfrey. But again, Mr. Harriet saw at the little dog and wanted to create again many questions like, are you giving are you giving him plenty of exercises? Give me the answer, Mr. Harriet asked. But at the same time, Mrs. Pumphrey replied, no, little exercise. Little exercise he does because he is energyless. Now what time? That's why. And the favorite food, what he takes, is not taking all these words listened by Mr. Harriet carefully. Now he is observing that dog patiently. Okay. First day, second day, third day, Mr. Harriet watched, observed that dog, tricky, very much. After observing, tricky a lot now the expectations raised in the mind of mr harrier that maybe maybe any day okay maybe after one day two day or three days call can come from the house of mrs pumphrey and the same thing happened same thing occurred mrs pumphrey rang up that trick is not feeling well about so vomiting occurred okay he is not having favorite food he is very helpless he is panting he is lying on a rug okay he is not little he is not doing little exercises then which type of steps should we take suddenly mr harriet asked commanded that Tricky, Tricky has to be hospitalized at any cost because without hospitalization, Tricky can't remove all these features of illness. Okay, then definitely Mr. Harriet considered that the owner of Tricky, Mrs. Pumphrey, can't allow Tricky to be admitted. Mrs. Pumphrey felt swooned. Mrs. Pumphrey said that, how can it be possible? I can't live without Tricky. Okay. Gradually, she got ready. And Mr. Harriet wrapped that dog in a blanket and got ready to drive away along with that dog. Okay. But at that glimpse, all the maids, servants rushed in and out, okay, for taking, for carrying all the materials, all the possessions of Tricky because Tricky was living in the standard of luxurious life. All the cushions, all the toys and the living things, what Tricky used to have at the home. So... Mr. Harriet thought, how can I take all these stuff in my car? It's not possible, okay? But anyway, somehow I can take. Finally, Mr. Harriet looked behind the car and everybody was in tears without the presence of Tricky. Students, today I discussed some phases of this chapter and it's not possible to take all the phases in one video because you have to understand you have to pay attention all these features gradually and step by step you have to take keep it in your mind and in the next video you will be sum up with new phases and different phases of this chapter and we will wind up this chapter with many vocabs, questions and other features. Thank you very much.